I'm just gonna mute literally everyone and try to 1v9 play for myself. Ooh, 10 gold right here. I must miss that. I'm playing to not miss CS. Like, as little CS missed as possible. Not like using any abilities on Heimer. Fuck! I missed one. Now I'm tilted! I'll put like a couple points in W for wave clear. I must have lost chapter gold. Fifty more gold. Take out Heimer's turrets first, so he loses his wave clear. Um, I've missed two CS this game. I could have 50 right now. I have to recall, so I might miss another CS. I missed 3 CS this game. This is like... The most consistent way to 1v9 is on his ear is just get like as perfect CS as possible. He has no TP. So I hard shoved this in the tower.
Think Plank's being soloed. Our jungler ganked bot and died. Yep, we gotta 1v9 it. We have to 1v9 it. Zach can gank mid right now. Since my top laner just died. Or Zach is like invading our jungle. I'm doing like Gromp right now. Oh, there he is. I still got stunned. No, no, I couldn't finish him off. I'm sad. Oh, I'm sad. His turrets are going to solo me over here. My perfect CS. Oh well. Loe, what's up? How you doing? Oh, do I miss out on this play gold? No. Missed out on a double kill. And plate gold. I just started taking tower and I didn't even realize. I was so focused on like, where are these Zac blobs at man? There's so many minions, like that's where my brain's at there. <laughs> Fuck. How are you getting soloed by Malphite? You're playing the most broken champ in the game. What? That's a kill. This is how you literally 1v9 on his ear. You just fucking farm. He takes scaling runes, gathering storm, lethal tempo. Try to get 10 CS in minutes. We punished uh, Heimer for having no flash there. Ulted into the tower for a free kill. If I see a random circle like appear near me, I just E away because it's Zach. Getting dragon, nice. I'm up two levels. Oh yeah. And then the uh, mute all tip is very good. Helps you focus on yourself. I'm never staying here. I can easily die to a gank. I don't know where Zach is. I have to stop hitting the minions, not in like pushing to me. He's gonna deny me this cannon. Fuck. Okay, I'm pretty sure Zach's in our jungle then. I I think I get dove. Brand's missing too. Okay, Zach's top. I can still get dove by Bran. Bran could be here. Yeah, Bran is here. Oh fuck, I'm dead. Ah, It's okay, Arjana stood under tower while that happened and I literally called it out. Like, we saw Brands, like, walk right here. Maybe there was a ward there or minions, sh like, showed him. But Arjana didn't move, like, after we see that on the map, so we just assume they don't have a map. They don't use maps. I'm gonna wait for a control word. The timer turret? So Heimer just recalled and his turrets are like pushing the wave still. That's kind of good for me. Okay, he cancelled his recall. 
Level all six brand is topside. He has no R. Don't take it, please. It's so rude. That was close. Take the raptors there. My Vigo's invading their jungle, so... I can't walk up to the wave yet, because they're all here. So, that's a raptor angle. As was finally punished for not having a support in his lane. Oh, not much extra gold I'm getting off these, um... These little turrets. I feel like I've gotten a lot from them so far. Next wave is kind of far away. I might be able to back from my boots here. Yeah, the enemy's in boots at 13 and a half minutes. Like, that's solid. We can just TP back. Oh, uh, they dropped Herald, so... I'm just gonna... I'm gonna catch, uh... This top wave. I have to kill this Herald, because our GP is like perma dying. 050, oh, oh, like wow. Just wow. I have unranked Gangplank. In my Diamond 1 Master game. And he's 050, oh, oh, what do you know? They're taking our jungle camps. I'm gonna take wolves. Like, we just need to constantly be farming with this playstyle. Now we go catch top wave. Boost spawning in a minute, we definitely want that. Bank plank is getting killed again. Oh my god, bro. Nice, he got out. Was that both the rolls? I just play for this top tower. Janna's dead. Gangplank is low, so we just trade we just try to trade this dragon for this top tower. Uh, it's so much easier to focus on how to actually play the game when there's not like everyone spam pinging and typing in this game. It's so nice and peaceful. Alright, we're gonna go buy a blue trinket and we're gonna try to go to this blue buff. I could have maybe dropped my tower instead for this way, but... It's like, pretty risky. I'm gonna go for Nashor now, because we want hella DPS. I believe it might be gone. I catch the mid wave here, maybe? Psych. I feel like this blue's gone. I think Zach maybe took it. Oh, nice. So after we get this blue, we're gonna head top. Vigo doesn't care to farm his jungle camp, so I will gladly take him. He's just running around the map. I'm gonna go walk over here and try to get a ward near top lane. We will unearth what has been lost. 
Yep, here they are. I just flashed into the wall by accident. And I live. Holy, I accidentally flashed in the wall. I tried to flash that Malphite ult, but my cursor, like, is not where I thought it was. At least I live there. Holy crap. We pre we can pretend we, we flashed that Malphite ult. We can pretend. I can check if their Krugs are up. It's slightly risky. Okay. They're not up. Yo! He's soloing Herald. <laughs> I can TP. I should TP here and try to stop Brand. Hmm? Where's the Herald? What? Huh? I'm so confused. Where did the Herald go? There was no herald on my screen there. Shurima lives in me. The order is given. We're just farming for Nasher. And then we can go fight his drag. After I get this top wave. It's up in a minute. A ruler must choose his hour. Okay, I'm coming. Me and Diego and Twitch is like pretty strong. Our GP is really low damage, but he does some AoE. Okay, never mind, they're fucking trolling. I think I'm on the way and they're like postured here by themselves. While our jungler is like getting mid prior, like... Yeah, you just wait for the team there. You don't, you don't fight. It's pretty simple. That's, uh, I think that was Heimerdinger ult. Alright, well. Okay, we killed Ezreal. That's good. Nice a double kill for me. Uh, I'm getting melted by this Heimer turret, bro. Yikes, I'm playing bad there. Because I'm just eating that Heimer turret. Oops. I, I could kill them all, but I misplayed that. I low-key lost where my champion was for like a second and a half there. I'm not sure why. Alright, what do we want to buy now? Yeah, Banshees would be good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do the Banshees. We can do Banshees and then Void Staff because they'll surely be buying a Mar by then on Malphite and Zac. Yeah, we focused on like farming all early game and just played for ourselves and now we're like, we have so much 1v9 potential because we have our item power spikes. It's a really selfish playstyle, but like you just have to play Azir this way. Like this is... Like the most optimal way to play is here. If you like need to 1v9 every game, which is pretty likely in solo queue. We just fucking take every CS possible. 
Our GPS teleport. He should have been bot lane. Because if I'm bot lane with Baron up, they'd be Baron. Fuck, I didn't get that. They have a Heimerdinger, like, they could rush this. Okay, they're not on it. Well, him and Zach could duo it, actually. I'm gonna go back for blue trinkets. He top when Baron is up. Oh, actually, my TP's up now. It doesn't matter what fucking side lane I'm in. But I'd rather match Heimer than Malphite. Damn, there's two bots here. If anyone, if any of these teammates were topside, we could just like rush Baron. I just commit to top wave. I take towers insanely fast. Because I'm really strong right now. I see Brand here. I'm gonna drop my tower. Ah. Uh. I'm getting collapsed on. I thought he would keep running at me for some reason. My bad on that ult. Level 15. Two levels over everyone. Now I just take Romp and Wolves. My fight went in and ulted based off what I just saw on the minimap, so... Okay, we're fighting. Zack engaged too. Zack entered. Okay, that's a free Baron. Enemy team like just forced a really bad engage. You can take this drag. I'm gonna go and push out top a bit because I have teleport. I can force them to come top here for me. And yeah, looks like they're not even gonna try, so... Free tower. Now I recall and I just TP to Dragon. Because if they can test this, they'd lose the entire game. Wait, if I saw this, I have Rabadon. Let's do that. So I'm watching here to see if there's a fight. There's no fight. Oh, okay, there's a fight. I have to TP here because none of my teammates gave me a good ward. And that's game over. He ulted away, let's end the game. End, 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 end. I told you I had 1v9 this game. Told you 1v9 mode was activated. Only thing that's like hard about this playstyle, cause like in solo queue, your teammates are just like monkey. They're absolute apes. So those just like constantly fight, and while you play for yourself, uh, your teammates just kind of int. And if you're against like a roaming assassin, like they'll just kill your bot lane over and over while you farm.
But if your team can hold out a little bit, and you just farm insanely well. Uh, then yeah, you get the scale and 1v9 the game. Just like that. This is how you 1v9 any game. You try to like emulate this playstyle. Just play for yourself. Mute your team. Take every farm you can. Boom. 1000 damage. Per minute. And they had a, like 11 or 12 CS a minute. Which is really, really good. And then you got the enemy team typing mid gap. Well, GG. That's how you do it. Hope you enjoyed all those tips.